here is where the F, the skincare goes. I'm gonna try to keep it real simple and keep it in an easy order. First thing you're gonna do, exfoliate. If you got dusty skin, crusty skin, little coagulation here, feels like, touch it, feels like sandpaper, get the dead skin off. I prefer using like exfoliating pads. The First Aid Beauty are some of my faves because they're gentle. Next, eye cream. You're gonna put on your eye cream before you slop your serums everywhere. Because once your serums get on your eyes, your eye cream is not gonna work the same. So your eye serum or your eye cream first. Yes, now we're doing the serums. If you use a vitamin C serum, an active serum, niacinamide, glycolics, a treatment serum. An active serum is anything that actively treats. This goes first. So it can actively treat, okay? So today I opted for the SkinCeuticals CE for Rulic. If you feel your skin is still dry, you can double serum by putting a hyaluronic over. The hyaluronic hydrating serums go over the C or the active serums. That is so they lock it in, maintain the moisture, but this has to treat the skin first. So I chose Peach and Lily. I put this over it. It's a very gentle, hydrating serum, and I put that right over it, okay? You lock it in with a moisturizer because the moisturizer, why do you need that? It maintains the moisture throughout the day. So I chose today, Sunday Riley. Now, if you should choose, you can opt for a moisturizer. Murad has a really great one with an SPF 30 or 40. Okay, there's a lot of great ones out there. So you avoid a step. Now, after this is when I put my SPF on. It's a mineral SPF. Today, I chose the Kosas. I prefer a mineral SPF because a mineral is an actual block and there is no chemical involved like titanium dioxide, zinc oxide, and it just blocks and the sun bounces off. A chemical SPF, like those avobenzenes and the other words that we hear, those are more, they kind of convert and push back out. When I can, I opt for a mineral. Then you put on the makeup and the whole rest of the stuff, but that's a whole other story. That's it. I hope this clarified. I hope this helps. I know it's super overwhelming. You can just do one serum, okay? If your skin is dry, just feeling very dry, you want to opt for just a hydrating hyaluronic serum, or if your skin is super sensitive, okay? If your skin is dull discoloration, you might want to opt for C, niacinamide, and something with like a lactic uh, or glycolic acids, okay? There's a lot more out there, but that's just kind of like, the basics, uh, right? Like the grilled cheese of skincare. I know it seems crazy, but we got this.